Hi, so today we're going to talk about premise. Um, when you talk about the premise of a poem, you're talking about what the poet is doing in, in the poem, more than what happens in the poem or what the poem is about. You could think of the premise as going back to the poet when the poet was conceiving of the poem and the poet came up with a, a sort of what if sort of uh, speculation. Um, Sometimes you can uh, uh, look at the title and the title will key you in to the premise of the poem. Um, sometimes looking, uh, examining the persona and the addressee will lead you to the premise. Um, there might be an extended metaphor that goes throughout the poem um, and that can be part of the premise. Um, and when you make a statement about the premise of a poem, you can phrase it in this poem, the poet because it's really about what the poet is, is doing in the poem. So let's take a look again at this poem, Gretel in Darkness. You can imagine that Louise Gluck, when she was conceiving of this poem, she thought, what if uh, Gretel, sometime after the events in the forest, were was still troubled um, by her memories of those events, and she was speaking to her brother about them. So that's the premise of the poem. In this poem, Louise Gluck imagines uh, um, Gretel speaking to her brother some years after the events in the forest. Um, in this poem, this is the William Carlos Williams poem that we looked at at the beginning of this unit, this is just to say. Uh, the premise of this poem is really that this, this poem is a note. Uh, this poem is a note that someone left as an apology note. So in this poem, William Carlos Williams imagines himself apologizing for something that he doesn't really feel sorry about. And the poem itself is meant to be the note. So you have this idea of the text type, which is important to consider to understand what the poem is doing. Um, and then that leads you to what the poem is, is about or what you could say the poem is, is about. The title is a bit of a lead in. This is just to say. This is just to say is the kind of thing that someone would write at the top of, of a short note. Um, in Long May You Run, you could think of Neil Young imagining uh, himself singing to his car, uh, to a car. So in this song, Neil Young sings to a car that uh, he used to own. So for this final one, I'm gonna ask you guys to uh, propose, what do you think the premise of this poem is? And you're gonna do this in the discussion board um, on Schoology. So uh, this is a poem called School Photo found after the Joplin tornado. The Joplin tornado was a massive tornado in 2011. Um, the poet Laura Dimmitt is from Joplin. Uh, she's a Midwestern poet. Um, so what I want you to do is to read this poem and think, you know, what is she doing? What is the premise? What's the idea? What's sort of the concept of, of this poem? Um, and, and then in the discussion, you're going to write in this poem, the poet, poet Laura Dimmitt, and then finish that sentence with the premise.